In this video, we will be walking through creating and sending flows with message templates. Flows contain a one-screen survey for users who attended a workshop to collect their feedback. When a user submits flows, the results will be sent to your webhook server. The first step is to create a message template with flows. In WhatsApp Manager sidebar, you will select Message Templates, Create Template. You will use a blank template and click Create New Template. Since you are creating a message for a survey, you will select the Utility category. In the following screen, you can customize the message template. You will give the message template a name. The name needs to be unique. You can use Feedback Survey. For the header, you're going to select text type from the dropdown and enter how did you find the workshop. For the body, you're going to enter help us improve. You're going to leave the footer empty and then for the button, you're going to enter take survey. For the type of flows, you're going to use the get feedback type. Then you're going to click create. In the following screen, you will customize the flows. You can change the screens in the flows and the components on each screen. You will remove the second screen as this survey will only have one screen. You will change the first screen title to Feedback Survey. Then you'll add another question. So let's add a component of type text, then select Small Heading and set the text to How Would You Rate the Workshop? And for the answer, you will add a drop down component, call it Rating. And then the option will be one-fifth, two-fifths, three-fifths, four-fifths, five-fifths. You can see the flows preview on the right side. Once you are happy with the survey, you're going to click Save to see the update in your preview and close the model. And then submit for review to submit the message template for review before you can send it. The template will show as in review. Then it will be active and you can send it. This can take several minutes. Wait for this step before you proceed. Once the template message becomes active, you can send it to a number to test it. You can use Graph API Explorer to send the message via CAPI. You can also use the WA Flows API Postman collection. Change to field to the phone number that will receive the message. Change name field to the name of the template you created. Then click Submit to send the message. Now let's look at what the user will see. They will receive a message. When they tap the button, it will launch the survey flows. After they complete the flows, a request will be made to the webhook server with the flows response. Let's see the logs on the webhook server when the user submits the flows response. The code for the webhook server is available in Node.js on GitHub. You can also fork and edit the code on Glitch in your browser. This is the request we will get on the webhook server when the user submits the flow. The request field message.type will be interactive and field message.interactive.type will be nfm underscore reply. Inside nfm underscore reply, we will find response underscore json, which contains the stringified response of the flows with the values the user selected. 